Hello everyone, this is Amity Sensei. I assume there are often times where you have a GPA image and you want to cut out something like this white part in the background to use it as a transparent background in a pin format. And most of you probably go on Safari and find an image with a transparent background like this too, but in this video I will show you how to do that easily instead. There's a really good app called Magic Eraser. It's free to download so go ahead and download it if you can. They got some ads like this here and there, but you can just tap and get rid of them. You'll be asked to join their premium version, but just click on this exponent in the corner if you don't want the option, and you'll be all set. This will be the first screen you see to begin with. Select Photos right here, and choose your photo. Tap Done, and then we have this magic eraser option that will easily let you erase things, so tap it. As you do that, only the white part gets cut out, and even here we have this apple and its shadow that's left a little bit, but tap it like this and you can easily erase it like this. Once you're finished, tap share, long tap your photo or the apple in my case here, and you have an option to save it in high resolution so select it, and now it should be in your camera roll. You can tell that the background is transparent here, and just like this, you can easily cut out only the background, and this goes same with other photos. Let me go back and choose a different photo. I'm going with the image of this car this time. You just have to select this and tap here. Now the background is gone. If you want to erase the window part here too, just tap around them and they will be erased. If you want to erase them by yourself, you can find this eraser option here. So adjust your brush size and work on the area you want like this shadow part here by tracing as well. If you find yourself erasing too much, this is the redo button in the middle right here. So just trace the area using this and you can redo only the part you erased. And once you cut it out, tap share, long tap this, and save it in high resolution. For the image that's cut out, you could use it in a note taking app for instance. Let me open good notes. I find it a good idea to paste in your notes. For example, this was the image before cutting out its background, and you can obviously see the white background, but with this one where its background is transparent, you can paste the object that's cut out, an apple in this case with any background in color, which will help make your note look pretty neat. This card right here looks better with its background cut out and transparent too. And I think this is pretty useful when making handouts and stuff. There are many other image editing apps including the ones that are more advanced, but you can just think of this app Magic Eraser as a tool to erase any background in an image. It's very intuitive and you can quickly erase your image background. So instead of using some apps that are a bit challenging to use, when you just want to erase your image background, I suggest going with an app like this one. Again, it's free, so download and give it a try if you can. And as I mentioned, you'll be asked to join their premium version too, but you don't necessarily have to do that. It works pretty well without it as well, so keep it in mind. Alright, that's all for today. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button down below. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet, I make videos on tips and hacks of iPad. So please do that too. Thank you for watching my video. I hope to see you in my next one. Bye bye.